The hardest part of chest needle decompression is being confident you're in the correct location, which is the fifth intercostal space anterior axillary line, simply meaning between the fifth and sixth rib, axillary line slightly forward or anterior to this location right here. Now, multiple ways to find it. You can count down each rib until you get the fifth and sixth rib and go between them, or the method I prefer is take your patient's hand, put it in there, relax, open up the pinky, and then mark it with your hand, lift up, and that's going to be right in that space when they do that. All right, it's going to be just below ideal nipple level. When performing this procedure, I prefer a North American Rescue ARS 10 gauge 3 and quarter inch needle. You're going to go over the top of the rib on your location here at a 90 degree angle of the body, inserting all the way until you've fully seated the needle catheter unit. Hold for 5 to 10 seconds or until relief is noted, leaving the catheter in place, remove the needle. Remember to monitor your patient after any invasive procedure. If respiratory distress returns, you're going to need to do another chest needle decompression or more definitive treatment like a chest tube.